Good evening, everyone. Sheila here in Boho Daydreams, so welcome to my channel. I hope you're having a good weekend so far. It's a little bit late, so I have my lights on. Um, and it's not really picking up the true color here of the little sweet pea laying on the table, but I am super excited. I have her finished. And sweet pea is the uh, the cardstock index card little ring journal. It's a little mini and she is gessoed and painted and papered and napkined and gessoed some more and stamped and bossed and the list goes on. And I finished her up today and I am just so excited about that. Now because it's a little bit dark this color here is a little bit off. It's a beautiful bright jewel tone teal. And in the video, it looks more on the blue side, but it is very emerald. Very, very, I should say it's emerald. It's very, very beautiful. It's like emerald like that. Anyway, um, I finished her. And I didn't do a whole lot on the inside because I love the color. I love how this little journal turned out painting-wise. So, oh, she's just so pretty. Pretty, 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 pretty. So we're just going to do a quick little flip through. You've already seen so much of, of this little journal already as we have gone through the different pages as in stages of painting. So I just have a little bow and I have a dangle there. And I just blinged her up with a little bit of antique lace and some some little, little jeweled flowers. Um, and... As you can see, look at how beautiful that is. So that, I just haven't covered a lot of that up. Um, there, are a, there are a couple of lace pieces that act as pages. And there's a dangle hanging off of this piece of antique lace. Just let me get into camera here. And I added a bit of trim to the bottom. I tried to keep the seaside feel of this. It's very light, very, um, it's, it flows. To me, it just flows. This is one of my favorite pages, and I just couldn't cover that up. I love how that turned out. And um, I also did a pink one that I'm working on right now. And it tur is turning out equally well with the way I painted it. And I might do a tutorial on that because... Um, it just really adds depth to the way we paint. I love that page. also love this page. So I just added some simple, simple, simple bling. And just some of the, oh, what's it? Uh, linen, some antique linen and just a little bit of silk. Just kind of blended it in well with the way the, the ferns were sitting there. A little, oops, I'm down too far. Just a little dangle hanging off of the bow. There's another antique piece of lace. And I designed it so that this, this little journal is not claimed. And if there's somebody out there that might like it, please let me know. I'm going to put my information in the description box. But these pieces can be used in other projects or even to complete this project. Um, and you can add little pictures. I left a lot of space so that if you have little pictures or little quotes that you want to add to your journal, you can do that. I have a couple of commissions too, so when they're done, I'm going to do little flip throughs of those. Just love that. Love the white embossing too. And I've, I've included in this video, in the description box, all the things that I used, including the embossing powder and the gold leaf and the cards, the ink, the special ink that um, I realized that we needed to use. I love that. This lace here is one of my favorite. It's so old. I know I'm braving it and starting to use my lace. I love, I love the way that's painted. I hope I can duplicate that.
I just did a little ruffle and added some jewels. I love, love that stamp or that embossing folder. If I can find that, I'm going to put that in the description box too. I haven't been able to find it though. I love it. I love that. And that is the end. I want to thank everybody who joined me in this adventure. Um, I want to thank you for all your kind words. Oh my goodness, I don't remember how many, how many bloopers <clears throat> I made, how many mistakes I made. And you were all so kind. That just oh, made me feel like I could continue on without feeling so nervous. I hope you all continue to have a wonderful weekend. Please share your pictures of your little sweet peas in the groups because, um, and tag me because I just love them. Anyway, I'm going to say goodbye for now. Bye-bye, and I hope you all have a wonderful weekend.